Hey, this is James in Zero WRL coming to you with some very important breaking news regarding defending our amateur radio spectrum. And you know it's breaking news because I'm filming this sort of ad hoc, but I wanted to get this out to you very quickly. So you can see the news post here on AMSAT UK. There is a commercial space company, AST and Science LLC or AST Space Mobile, that is using amateur radio spectrum for commercial use and they're petitioning the FCC to allow them to do this. So they currently have five commercial satellites that are in operation and using the amateur radio 430 to 440 megahertz band or the 70 centimeter band. Um, and they are planning to launch another 243 satellites for TT and C, which is telemetry tracking and command. Um, and they're petitioning the FCC to allow them to do so. So right off the bat, this is a little strange. Uh, I'm not exactly sure how they're even able to operate these satellites already within that amateur radio spectrum without somehow getting fined or prevented from doing so but they do seem to have done that so i'll link you guys to this amsat.uk so you can read this maybe some of you guys can shed some more light on what exactly um, is going on here if you click the link here president peter um, golzo of amsat dl db2os uh, has done some good analysis on this as well as well and uh, some of the other folks in this libra space thread have done some analysis and uh, gathered observations um, of the passes of those satellites so you can see and get an idea of exactly the interference that this would cause to uh, amateur radio operators. Personally, I've just been getting into satellite uh, operations and so this is sort of scary to have potentially this much interference on that 430 to 440 megahertz band that we use for satellite operations. But this is also just critical in amateur radio for technological advancement and continuing to use our amateur radio satellites. So there is a link in the main article here in order to uh, make a comment with the FCC. And so I would just, I would reach out and urge everybody to at least make a comment. And, you know, every time there is a threat to the amateur radio spectrum or every time a commercial entity is trying to come in and make some changes or allocate some of the amateur radio spectrum for their uses. I, I don't mean and I don't think we mean and other amateur radio operators mean to be alarmist, but this really is a situation where if you give an inch, they take a mile and we only have the amateur radio spectrum that we have. So every time there is one of these attempts to reallocate some amateur radio spectrum. It's really important that we let the FCC know that we're here, that we're paying attention and that we use this spectrum so that we can prevent reallocation of this spectrum for other sources. So I'm just going to show you really quick how this works. So you click on to uh, submit an express comment. And then once you are in here, you can enter your name. Um, and other details. And uh, I've already written here uh, an example of how I would respond to this. AST and Science LLC, ST Space Mobile is operating satellites in the amateur radio spectrum, causing interference with amateur radio operations. I strongly urge you to deny their request to use amateur radio frequencies for commercial use. I personally am an amateur radio operator, call sign along with over 750,000 Americans. These frequencies are vital for emergency communications via satellite and amateur radio, as well as technological advancement in the radio science by amateur radio operators. And so I am about to send this off. So I would just say to everyone out there, please make a comment, please respond, please let the FCC know that amateur radios are out here. We're using this spectrum and we don't want reallocation. So this is James in zero WRL saying 73. Thanks for your attention on this. And I hope to hear you on the air soon. We've helped over 60,000 students get their US FCC amateur radio license, and we can help you too, no matter your age or educational background. Go to www.hamradioprep.com and try a free lesson today.